Learn how to write a credit line increase letter to U.S. Small Business Administration. Not sure how to write a credit line increase letter? Choose this sample to create the document, then send it to SBA. Please, follow the link in the description to open the document form. Now, you can start to fill out the form. Begin with your company's name, an example, Company Example LLC. Next, enter your company's address line 1, PO Box 123. Address line 2, Miami, Florida 12345. Now, enter your phone number, 123-456-7890. And the email address you own, example at example.com. Choose your document date. Next, type the SBA Office Department name, an example, Office of Business Development. You can find the respective SBA department by following the official link www.sba.gov. Now, add the office department address line 1. 409 3rd Street, SW Suite 8800. Address line 2, Washington DC 20416. Then, enter the current loan number or application number provided by SBA. Let's say, loan number 12345689. Next, write the loan amount you are asking SBA to increase, an example, $500,000, and the percentage of the company's revenue increase, an example, 10%. Now, enter the company's executive. I am the founder and CEO. Lastly, type your first and last name, John Doe. Good job, your document is ready. Check your personal information one more time, and click to the buy button. Proceed with the payment to download and print out the document from your computer. Please, do not forget to sign the document and attach the respective exhibits. Finally, send the letter by USPS Certified Mail. Certified Mail is best because it guarantees that the SBA receives it. That way, they can't say they didn't get your letter. But, if you are busy and don't have time to drive to the post office, you can mail a letter online. No more trips to the post office, no worries of social distancing, save time and do it online with lettercarrier.org. Important, you can keep a document copy on your computer, but it's better to keep a hard copy of the one you sign and send. Always keep a copy of the document, certified mail receipt, payment receipt, so you have a record. If you enjoyed this video, please subscribe, like and share it with your friends. Looking for a particular document form? Kindly leave a comment below, and we will consider your request. Thanks for watching.